The Nigeria Customs Service Federal Operations Unit Zone C has seized contraband goods with a duty value of 2,757,000,000 naira. The acting controller in charge of the zone, Kola de Kayode, says the seized goods underscores the determination of the service to enforce all laws relating to the importation and exportation of goods into and out of Nigeria. Our correspondent compiled this report. It's another round of successes recorded by the officers and men of the Nigerian Customs Service, Federal Operation Unit Zone C, as they showcase the items they seized from smugglers within the short time. Speaking to newsmen, the acting controller, Kola de Kayode, says the zone has intercepted various contraband goods worth billions of naira. Our operational modalities, based on the approved standard operating procedure, the unit lived up to its responsibility by intercepting various contraband with duty paid value 2 billion 757 million. Six hundred seventy-six thousand three hundred ninety naira only. I repeat, two billion seven fifty-seven million six hundred seventy-six thousand three hundred ninety naira only between January twenty-fifth to March twenty-fifth, twenty twenty-three. After conducting newsmen around the seized items, Canada said the fight against smuggling can only be won if all hands are on deck. It's worrisome, and we will try all our best to make sure we combat it. We are out, my boys are everywhere, the Eagles' eyes are everywhere, they are working, and they will continue the work. Sleepless nights, we work all around the clock. Our boys are being attacked day and night, but with Almighty God, we are able to stay true. They seize contraband goods include sacks of pangolins, Indian M. Cartons of coarse syrup with codeine and bulletproof exotic vehicles. Others are bales of second hand clothing, bags of smuggled rice, and various medicines, including tramadol. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.